Remember a story we discussed yesterday, a lawsuit being filed against Secretary of State Michael Adams and the State Board of Elections. The lawsuit filed by the Kentuckians for the Commonwealth alleges an election law passed in 2021 violates a national act for protecting voter integrity. WBKO Sarah Phipps spoke with Adams today on the lawsuit and joins us now live in the studio. Thank you, Casey. This lawsuit is in reaction to House Bill 574, which originally started as a response to the COVID-19 pandemic and later became a permanent change to election law in 2021. The law prevents voters registered in different states from voting here in Kentucky. What we're talking about here is a modest number of people who both moved to another state and then they told their secretary of state in their new state, I'm voting here now. Well, you can't be registered in multiple states. That's against the law. Uh, and there certainly was no intent by Congress when they passed a federal law to allow multi-state voting. KFTC alleges HB 574 violates the National Voter Registration Act of 1993. They say the act requires voters who have moved to receive a written notice of their removal to confirm their address and give them adequate time to respond. People who move out of state, I don't mean register out of state, I mean just simply move out of state. We do send those people notices and we actually, we want them to tell us. We want to tell us, hey, is this right? Did you move out of state? And if so, do you want to deregister from the rolls or do you want to stay on the rolls? And if they don't tell us either way, we leave them on the rolls just to be safe. Uh, so we've really been over backwards to make sure that we don't disenfranchise anybody. With the law being contested having been passed three years ago, Adams questioned the reasoning behind the lawsuit, claiming the KTFC is trying to, quote, sow chaos and doubt in our elections. So their intent here is to disrupt an election. Uh, so I do expect this to be briefed and argued pretty quickly. Uh, probably late summer, uh, early fall is when we'll get in front of the judge and make our case. But, but again, these folks sat on this for years and then they waited to the last minute to blow this election up. And so uh, we're gonna make sure they're not successful. Though with that, Adam said he does fear that if the lawsuit is successful, the state will lose bipartisanship regarding election policy. I'll never be able to get Republicans to trust Democrats and vote on something that both sides get something out of. Because if the Democrats vote for this stuff, and they come around and sue and try to knock it out. There's just, there's no trust. You have to have trust. Kentucky is one of 19 states that explicitly prohibits voting in more than one state, with every state and Washington, D.C. having policies against double voting. Reporting in studio, Sarah Phipps, WBKO News.